this is a circuit with dependent source as you can see the dependent source at the left of the circuit and also at the right of the circuit here is the symbol for the dependent current source therefore the unit will be ampere and then this is the dependent voltage source and the unit will be voltage so here is ampere if this kinds of dependent source is exists in the circuit what you have to do is there is an additional equation that you have to create so that it can be one of the equation in the nodal for example for this constraint equation we call it as a constraint equation there will be additional equation which is what is i node what is vx i node can be determined by finding the equations for the i node and same as the vx as stated in the circuit for the i node you can see that the currency is flowing from the v i uh, v one to the v two. Therefore, the polarity for the three ohms is look like this one. So i nodes is equal to v at three ohm equal to three ohms. V at positive, which is v one, must be minus with the v two over 3 so this is the equation for the i node as for the vx so the priority for the positive is 0 and then positive priority for the negative is v2 therefore vx is 0 minus v2 and then this constant equation will be substitutes into the nodal equation 